In this video, we're looking at the mean, the median, the mode, and the range. The mean, the median, and the mode are three different types of averages, and the range is a measure of how spread out the data is. Let's look at the first example. We have a list of 10 numbers, and the first question is asking us for the range. To find the range, we take the biggest number, we get the biggest number, so for these 10 numbers, that's 7. And we take away the smallest number, which for these numbers is 2. So the range is 7 take away 2, which is 5. The mode is the most common number, the number that appears most often. So which one appears most often? We've got three threes. We haven't got three of anything else, so 3 is the mode and the mean the mean is the average that's used the most often when people say average they usually mean the mean and to find the mean we add up all the numbers and divide by how many there are so we're going to do 2 plus 2 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 4 plus 4 plus 5 plus 6 plus 7 all the numbers added together and divided by how many there are, which is 10. So let's add up all these numbers. I'm going to add up as I go. So 2, 4, 7, 10, 13, 17, 21, 26, 32, 39. So we could have used a calculator for that if we had one available. 39 over 10. So 39 divided by 10 is 3.9 so the mean is 3.9 here's a question for you to try so give this one a go so this time we have five numbers the first question is asking for the range so that's the biggest take away the smallest so the biggest number here is 11 the smallest is 6 so 11 take away 6 is 5. Write down the mode. The number that appears most often is 10. There are two 10s. And the mean, so we add them all up. So 6 plus 8 plus 10 plus 10 plus 11 divided by how many there are, which is 5 this time. 6 and 8 make 14, plus 10 is 24. Another 10 makes 34. And another 11, 34 plus 11 is 45. So 45 divided by 5, and that's 9. So the mean is 9. Here's another example. We've got the heights of 7 plants. And they're not in order. And the first question is asking for the range. So we want the biggest... So the biggest one here is 52. Take away the smallest, which is 35. So 52 take away 35, that's 17. So the range is 17. Part B is asking for the median height. So the median is a different type of average, and that tells us the middle number. So we need to put them in order first. So let's start with the smallest, which is 35. Then we have 37 and 40, 45, 46, 49, and 52. So which one's the middle number? So if we cross off three on each side, we can see the middle number is 45. So the median height is 45 centimetres. And one for you to try. So this time you've got the weights in grams of nine objects. Give this one a go. So the first question is asking for the range. So it's the biggest number which is 98 take away the smallest number 
which is 54. So 98 take away 54 is 44. So the range is 44. We could say 44 grams or just 44. Work out the medium weight. So that's the middle number. So we need to put them in order first. So let's start with the smallest, 54. Then we have 58. That's the only other one in the 50s. In the 60s, we've got 65. Then the 70s, 72. 74. Onto the 80s, 83. 84. 84. And 91, 98. So we've got nine numbers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we can cross off four on both sides. And the middle number, the median, is 74. So it's 74 grams. Here we have another question asking for the median. This time we have eight plants. To work out the median, we need to put the numbers in order first. The median is the middle number. So let's put these in order. So the lowest number, the smallest number is 60. Then we have 61. We have 65 and 68. They're all the numbers in the 60s. Now the 70s, we've got 70, 72, 72 again, and 74. So we need the median, the middle number. If we cross off from both sides, we can cross off three from both sides, and we're left with two numbers in the middle. Whenever we have an even number of numbers, we're going to be left with two numbers in the middle. And to find the median, we go halfway in between them. So the median is halfway in between 68 and 70. And that is, what well, it's 69. So the median is 69 centimetres. And we could also work this out, if you don't know what halfway between them is, by doing... Well, the mean of these two numbers. So if you add two numbers up and half them, you find the middle of those two numbers. So in this case, the median is 69 centimetres. Here's one for you to try. So give this one a go. So again, we're finding the median. We need to put the numbers in order first. So we've got 105 is the smallest. Then we have 113, 114, 118, 121, and 126. So the numbers are in order. We need the middle. We can cross off two from both sides. And again, we're left with two numbers in the middle. So we're going halfway in between them, halfway in between 114 and 118. So 114 plus 118 divided by 2, which will give us 116. So the median weight is 116 grams. Halfway in between 114 and 118 is 116. Here we have a different question. We have some number cards and one of the cards is hidden. So we know what six of the numbers are, but we don't know the number on the seventh card. We are told the mean of the numbers on the cards is five and we need to find the hidden number. So let's think about what the mean is. To find the mean, we do the sum, we add up all the numbers and divide by how many numbers there are. So all the numbers added up, divided by how many, which I've just called n, is equal to the mean. So in this question, 
We know how many numbers there are. There are seven in total. And we know the mean is five. So we can work out what the numbers add up to. So to get the sum by itself, we need to multiply both sides by seven. So the sum of all the numbers must be seven times five, which is 35. So all the numbers add up to 35. So what's the missing number? Well, let's look at what we've got so far. So nine and two make 11. 11 plus eight is 19. Add three is 22. Add six is 28. Add four is 32. So we have 32 so far. We need to have 35. So the missing number must be three. So this card must be a three for the mean to be five. And here's a question for you to try. So give this one a go. So again, we've got some number cards and one is hidden and we are told the mean. So this time there are five numbers and their mean is eight. So the sum of the numbers must be five eights. So the numbers must add up to 40. For the mean to be eight, the numbers have to add up to 40. So we've got nine and five, which is 14. Add seven, which is 21. Add eight, which makes 29. So what is missing? Well, we've got 29 so far. We need 40. So 40 take away 29 is 11. So the missing number has to be 11. And to finish up, we've got two questions. Pause the video, give them a go and press play when you're ready for the answers. Question one, part A is asking for the range. The range is the biggest, take away the smallest. So we have got 12 is the biggest, two is the smallest number, 12 take away two is 10. Write down the mode. So which number appears the most times? We've got three fives and there aren't three of anything else. So the mode is five. The median is the middle number. So we need to put the numbers in order first. So we'll start with the smallest, which is two. Then we've got three fives, a seven, eight, nine, another nine, a 10 and a 12. So what's the middle number? So we can cross off from both sides cross off four from both sides and we're left with seven and eight in the middle. So the median is halfway between seven and eight. Halfway between seven and eight is 7.5. And we could have done seven plus eight divided by two to find that as well. Part D says work out the mean. So that's all the numbers added up divided by how many there are. So we're gonna have seven plus eight plus five, plus nine, plus 10, plus 12, plus five, plus five, plus nine, plus two. And there are 10 numbers. So it's divided by 10. So seven and eight make 15. Add five is 20. Add nine for 29. Add 10 for 39. Add 12 makes 51. Two fives will get to 61. Add nine for 70 and two for 72. So it's 72 over 10. You could have used a calculator for that if you've got one available. 72 over 10 is 7.2. And question two, we've got some number cards and two cards are hidden. The mean of the numbers is six and the mode is eight. So the mean is six. There are six numbers as well. So the sum 
they must all add up to 6 times 6, which is 36. So for the mean to be 6, they must add up to 36. And the mode is 8. So there has to be at least one more 8. So let's say one number is 8. And let's see what they add up to. So 8, 2 is 10. And 8 is 18. Add 3 makes 21. Add 6 makes 27. So we've got 27 so far. We need 36. 36 take away 27 is 9. So we must have 8 and 9.